Today, we were reminded that only God gives true love. How has God shown his love to you? He sent Jesus to die for your sins. And because God loves you and me so much, we should love him back. Our memory verse has been about that. Matthew 22, 37 through 39. And he said to him, you shall love the Lord your God with all your heart and with all your soul and with all your mind. This is the great and first commandment. And a second is like it. You shall love your neighbor as yourself. Matthew 22, 37 through 39. Who said these words? That's right, Jesus did. Now, since Jesus is talking, is this in the Old Testament or the New Testament? If you said the New Testament, then you're correct. Which follower of Jesus heard him say these words and wrote them down so that we could know what Jesus said? That's right, it was Matthew. All of God's word tells the same truth about God and his love for us. Jesus reminds us how important it is for us to love God and others. Let's say our verse together. Matthew 22, 37 through 39. And he said to him, you shall love the Lord your God with all your heart and with all your soul and with all your mind. This is the great and first commandment. And a second is like it. You shall love your neighbor as yourself. Matthew 22, 37 through 39. And he said to him, you shall love the Lord your God with all your heart and with all your soul and with all your mind. This is the great and first commandment. See, the first and greatest commandment is to love God first and most. You can't love God on your own, but he gives you a love for him as you read his word and get to know him better. What are some ways that you can show your love for God? That's right, you can spend time in his word. And a second is like it. You shall love your neighbor as yourself. When Jesus said neighbor, who is he talking about? If you said everyone, then you're correct. You can't love like this on your own. When you love God first, he gives you this love for other people. He helps you think of them before you think of yourself. Jesus helps you love other people like he does. Think of some ways God has shown you to love others since we started learning this verse. Let's say it together again. Matthew 22, 37 through 39. And he said to him, you shall love the Lord your God with all your heart and with all your soul and with all your mind. This is the great and first commandment and a second is like it. You shall love your neighbor as yourself. Matthew 22, 37 through 39. If you know Jesus is your savior, God will change your heart by his grace so you can love others. Your heavenly father gives true love. Now, what is grace? Say it with me. God's amazing kindness to us, even though we don't deserve it. God's grace works in your life so that you can show that you love God by loving others. Then you can tell them about your loving Heavenly Father. Word up, tell one another. If you haven't believed in Jesus as your Savior, you need to know that God loves you and wants to change your heart. Jesus showed his love to you by dying on a cross for your sins. He knew sin was too powerful for you to get rid of on your own. Taking the punishment for your sin was the ultimate act of love. He wants you to come to him, believing that he is God the Son who can take away your sins. Will you believe in him today? Let's say the verse together one more time. Matthew 22, 37 through 39. And he said to him, You shall love the Lord your God with all your heart and with all your soul and with all your mind. This is the great and first commandment. And a second is like it. You shall love your neighbor as yourself. Matthew 22, 37 through 39. Now we're going to play crazy groups. So if you have a pet, stand up and say the verse. Ready? Matthew 22, 37 through 39. And he said to him, You shall love the Lord your God with all your heart and with all your soul, and with all your mind. This is the great and first commandment. And a second is like it. You shall love your neighbor as yourself. Matthew 22, 37 through 39. Great job. Now, those who play a sport, stand up and say the verse. Ready? Matthew 22, 37 through 39. And he said to him, You shall love the Lord your God with all your heart, and with all your soul, and with all your mind. This is the great and first commandment. And a second is like it. You shall love your neighbor as yourself. Matthew 22, 37 through 39. Great job. Last one. Get ready. Those who got candy for Valentine's Day, stand up and say the verse. 
Matthew 22, 37 through 39. And he said to him, you shall love the Lord your God with all your heart and with all your soul and with all your mind. This is the great and first commandment. And a second is like it. You shall love your neighbor as yourself. Matthew 22, 37 through 39. Great job, kids.